I'm sorry I've been a little bit AWOL. Obviously I did Vlogmas and I clearly burnt myself out because I then didn't vlog after it at all. In my defence, I had a very chilled Christmas. I hope you did too. And then at the start of this year, I was quite ill and I just didn't fancy vlogging when I was ill. This video is going to be a little life update. We're getting ourselves together in January. Starting with tomorrow morning, I'm doing my first ever proper reformer Pilates. I'm doing Pilates every single day, which okay, in fairness, I haven't done every single day because I was ill, but I've done most days or I've done like a little bit every day because I'm basically doing like another little transformation video. I've got links to all the YouTube videos that I've been following. So I'll come out with a results video at the end of this month when I'm finished. I feel like the darkness and the winter vibes are not doing well with me right now, but I also feel like everyone feels this way in January. Not everyone maybe, but a lot of people do. Everyone gets January blues. I'm doing dry January. I'm trying to reduce my sugar. It's sort of like no fun January, <laughs> but I'm going skiing in a couple weeks. Well, no, literally in a week. <laughs> I can't complain. That should be very fun and we'll have some good vlogs from that. This vlog is just gonna be a little weekend in my life in January. Fitness, health, wholesome vibes. See you in the morning. It's the next morning now. I'm feeling a lot better today and I'm ready to go and do my Pilates class. I feel like a Pilates mum right now. This is what I'm wearing all black so I feel kind of slim. All black slims you out doesn't it? I'm not sure if I'll film anything in there but I will try. I'll try my best. I've arrived at Bliss's house. I'm just waiting for her to come down from her flat. Reforma Pilates, in case you don't know, I've seen so many models online say that they love Reforma Pilates and the fact that that's what gets them in shape. I'm really excited but I am kind of nervous as well because the Pilates that I've been doing at home for the past 20-ish days, actually no it's only January 19th and I missed a few days so probably like 15 days, is literally just home workouts and I usually do them for 10 minutes. But I think that's just willpower and the fact that it's cold outside. When it's cold I don't really want to work out and it's bloody freezing at the moment. I forgot how cold it is. I don't know where the Scottish accent come from i don't think it's very good scottish accent either <laughs> one of my little pleasures in life is when you have to wait for things but you're in a comfortable place i actually i find myself really enjoying my own company if i'm in a comfortable place and i'm waiting i love it in fact that's sometimes why i love car journeys is because i'm just with myself hanging out listening to the exact music that i want to listen to and i don't have to feel bad that the person next to me doesn't like the music i love it yeah, so right now I'm thoroughly enjoying it. I'm having a little sing song. Might have a little dirt on my boots, but I'm taking you uptown tonight. I love it. I love John Pardy at the moment. He's a great country singer. And if anyone has tickets to go see John Pardy in London, very jealous. Can I come with? It's so funny. I had a cold yesterday and I swear to God I did have a cold, but then I think, did I just bring on that cold with my mind? Was I just not in a very good place mentally yesterday? I think that's probably what it was. And then it makes me think, is it because you didn't have, like I had stuff to do? I don't know. Why is it you wake up some days and feel amazing and you wake up other days and you feel like mud on a boot, you know? Feeling a little bit puffy today though. That's not, that's not good. I'm feeling very double chinny. Yeah, so hopefully Pilates will help get rid of my double chin because I don't want a double chin. It's no respect to you, double chin, but... Oh, and Bliss is here now. <laughs> okay, it's time to go. Place. That was a lot of fun, I tell you that for free. It was so different, but also it felt so nice to stretch. I feel like I've never been stretched out like that in my whole life. But yeah, now I'm gonna go home and eat some lunch. Probably eggs, avocado. Guten Morgen. It's the next morning, about 11 a.m. And if you wanna know how I'm spending this weekend, this is probably an accurate representation of what I'm doing right now. Laying on my bed. 
I'm filming some content this weekend, maybe editing some stuff, but otherwise, to be honest, this is what my January's look like. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, this is what my January's look like. Kind of just, it's kind of sad, but I'm kind of just like counting down until I go away skiing next week. That's why I'm not sad. Usually I get really sad in January. I'm not too sad. I know I was a little bit sad at the start of the video, but I'm all right. I'm just chilling, you know, I'm just kind of hibernating like a little hamster, just trying to lose some weight. But yeah, not really exercising that much apart from the Pilates yesterday, which I love. I did some dancing this morning and I'm going to get my trampoline out later. I miss doing that. It's just more, I haven't got it out yet because it's outside in the summer house and I just really can't be bothered to go outside and get it. So that's why I've avoided it the last 19 days. <laughs> it's a good eyelash day for me. I'm packing for skiing today, which is so scary. This time next week, I'm going to be in Austria probably freezing my tits off. I'm so scared. I am gonna be vlogging while I'm there, FYI. I'm gonna make my favorite, I'm really craving it. It's scrambled oats. Oh, I love it. I love, 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 love it. It's like squishy granola. I dream about it. Like I sit here and I just dream about it and I'm salivating right now just thinking about it, but I'm going to try on some ski outfits. How's your January going, eh? Leave it in the comments. Describe your January in three words. I'm gonna do mine. Mine is dull, patience, And I want to say building blocks, but then that's four words. So maybe I'll do building blocks and patience because that's what I feel like this January has been. I'm just waiting. I'm like setting myself up for the year, which is good, you know? Not every month can be fun. And this month has been pretty darn boring. I saw Elliot for one weekend, which was fun. But even then, like I, I didn't drink I'm doing dry January. I'm not saying you need to drink to have fun, but also like I'm on a diet, quite a strict diet. We went out to Nando's, but I had like, I had a kid's meal. <laughs> <laughs> little hack by the way to get nando's for 5.95 get a kid's meal it wasn't even that bad it was it was like a small burger and some broccoli and some sweet corn i loved it <laughs> in case you wanted to see it because i didn't show you i was a little bit hungry this was what my scrambled oats looked like 10 out of 10 banging would definitely recommend to anyone <sighs> That is probably an accurate representation of this month. And I feel like everyone just feels like that. I feel like for me, as I think I did mention, I'm just waiting around, which is, I know, not how you're supposed to live your life. I've just got nothing to do until I go skiing. So I'm literally just waiting to go skiing. And I feel like I can't even relax. I feel like I've, I should use this time to really relax, you know? And I struggle to relax, period. It was really depressing. I said to my mum, I've not felt joy once this month. But I know it's not a problem because... Yeah, I agree. I know it's not a problem because I know I will feel joy once I actually... I don't... I don't know. I'm not feeling good. I'm going skiing though, so that'll fix it. I feel fat. I'm losing weight. But it's taking a lot longer than I thought. Maybe that's the problem, you know? Like I'm trying on my clothes and I'm like... No! No, it's not fitting how I want it to fit. It's probably the problem. See how I'm already like, I'm lighter in the way I'm speaking because I'm actually just being truthfully honest. I like to pretend that being heavier doesn't affect me, but it does. And I'm following my diet very, very well. I feel like I'm, I'm not exercising as much as I know I could be, but I'm, so what? I'm following the diet, that's all that matters. I'm doing Pilates every day. Okay, only like a 10 minute video, but I'm still doing it, you know? I feel like I really beat myself up and I don't let myself relax because I'm self-employed, freelance slash self-employed. And I feel like I should always be working towards my goals, but sometimes I run out of things or I'm not in the right headspace to work towards those goals. So I just sit there and beat myself in my head. <laughs> beat myself up. That's just, that's just me being honest. I'm really loving Love Island All Stars. That is the maximum joy I've felt this month. I can tell it's stressing me out as well because I feel very bloated and my stomach hurts. My stomach hurts when I'm stressed. I just think I just need to just like, just chill Darcy. Like, oh, sometimes I just, I wish I didn't have a voice in my head. It's always that voice in my, oh God, I've just massaged a bit my back, it feels nice. That mountain, 
We're gonna have some good times up that mountain. Yikes. I'm getting my head on Tuesday, which I'm very excited about. You might remember if you watched my Vlogmas, I wanted to get rid of the red, but that didn't really work. We're going with a light brown, and then we're doing highlights slash maybe balayage. I don't know. I want to have blonde hair. <laughs> I'm going back to blonde. Bronze, maybe is more of an accurate description. I might end the video here. I feel like it is kind of ending it on a low because I'm now suddenly not in a very good mood, but also I feel like I'm in a reflective mood. So maybe I'll, I don't know, maybe I'll do some journaling or something. I'm not sad. I just, I'm nothing right now. I feel nothing. I think it just goes to show like the importance of doing things with other people, making plans with friends, treating yourself, because when I don't treat myself or do anything, I just end up miserable. <laughs> And the, the thing is, I've got nothing to film about at home as well. So I can't even just do like content things on my channels. I can do stuff for my weddings, but I, I end up getting really stressed that that's not going to go how I want it to go. But it's okay. Life is like that. You know, it's fun. It's all a part of the journey. And that right now, I'm going to listen to some music because that's my favourite thing to do when I'm not feeling too good. It's just listen to some music, maybe a little bit of karaoke. I'm going to have a night in. I'm watching Euphoria again for like maybe the third time, which I'm enjoying. I imagine I will next see you very soon. I hope to do a lot more vlogging this year. <sighs> Thank you for watching and I'll see you soon.